is an important aspect of grammar and it is essential to clear clinical communication. Many students often confused when to use simple past or present perfect. Once again, this is Shamina Salim from Tijus Academy. So without any ado, let's move on to the video. Simple past tense is used to describe an event in the past which is resolved. For example, Mrs. Wilson gave birth five weeks ago. In this example, we are communicating to the reader that the baby has arrived and there is no complication from birth. It is also possible to use past tense with condition which is ongoing but stable, that is diabetes which is well controlled with medication. For example, Mr. John was diagnosed with diabetes in 2011 for which he takes regular medication. Although the condition is stable and patient still has diabetes, we consider the event is completed and it is stable. So, when we use present perfect tense with diagnosis, there are mainly two situations. In situation one, when the condition is unstable. For example, Mr. Matthew has been diagnosed with asthma and prescribed an inhaler. He will return to the clinic next month to review his inhaler. In this situation, the inhaler needs to be reviewed and if the inhaler effectiveness is not proved, he may need another medication. In situation 2, when the condition is new to the reader. For example, she has been diagnosed with unstable angina and requires follow-up care. This is a new information to the reader. So I hope you got a clarity regarding how to use simple past tense and present perfect tense with diagnosis. So you can practice it. See you in the next video.